Neil. Hey, how you Sorry, doing, thanks for waiting. I, oh, I appreciate thank it. Thank you. Thank you for having me. <laughs> Straight out of Compton. This I just saw this last weekend. How crazy has it been since it came out? Because it's getting so much. You waited that long to see it. My boyfriend doesn't like to go see opening weekends. I, trust me, I, 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 I know the feeling. Yeah, no, I'm sorry, I cut you off. What were you saying? How, how has it been? All the, there's so much positive feedback. It was such an amazing film. Oh, it's been great. It's rare to get that. You know what I mean? Especially in this industry, something you know, sometimes it's very hit or miss. Uh, so uh, with this one, with everybody putting their heart and soul into it, especially you know F. Gary, this was so personal to him that we knew we were gonna. It was his masterpiece, and he made it that way. So it, it's it's very warm, very humbling to have people really uh, appreciate what we did. It was, in, it was in development for so long, and yeah. then all of a sudden, it was worth the wait. Absolutely. How did it come across your desk? Um, I, I auditioned. My, my manager, actually, uh, a good friend, another actor, Corey Hardrick. Uh, you know, Tia, Tia and Tamara, the, the, Tia Maori's Hardrick, her husband. It's a good friend of mine. He kept calling me. He said, hey, man, you need to get in on this straight out of Compton thing. And I'm like, yeah, they're not going to cast me. What are they going to cast me for? And um, I ended up calling my manager, and they had already had the audition. I, I auditioned, didn't go anywhere. Three months later, they called and said, re-audition. Now it's going somewhere. It's just you never know with these things, right? That's really nice to hear that, too, because you get to that point where you're like, is this going to happen or not? And yeah, then all of a sudden, it, it just falls together. Yeah, I, when I thought it was going to happen, it was like nothing. They're like, no, nah, you're not as good as you thought you would, kid. Get out of here. And then when I was like, eh, whatever, it happened. Well, you got to have a lot more upcoming projects. What do you have? Um, I, I cannot talk about it right now, but I will say that NBC and Sony has been very nice to me, and uh, things are going fairly well right now. Yeah, oh, I can't yeah. wait to hear like yeah, what it ends I mean, up yeah, being. I can't wait to talk about you know what's going on. <laughs> and I gotta ask you, since we are at Horror Nights, sure. what's your favorite scary movie? Uh, it's gonna be Night of the Living Dead. Yeah, I'm a purist. You know what I mean? Which maze do you go to first tonight? Um, you know, I haven't been to the uh, Halloween Horror Nights here yet. I normally go to. The, I used to live in Florida, and oh, yeah, the Orlando one, which is. Huge, it's it's, it's huge. <laughs> you know, it's 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 much bigger. Uh, so I don't I don't know, man. I don't I don't know. This is gonna be a first for me. I'm excited. Well, have so much fun. They're, they're all gonna be amazing. They're so good. I'm sure, Universal doesn't slouch. Exactly. Well, thank you so much. Thank you very How are you going? Nice.